Self-driving cars might not be on the road today, but a closer look at the Canadian International Auto Show reveals we're getting close. Leading the pack is Ford, who's already promised to have a fully self-driving vehicle on the market by 2021. The North American manufacturer has invested heavily in the research and development of autonomous technology and making it work in all weather conditions. Ford has even forged partnerships with top innovators like the University of Michigan to help its cause. And we spoke with Mark Vegman, product marketing manager for cars at Ford for more information. We partnered with the University of Michigan. They have a campus called M-City because we, of course, want to design a fully autonomous vehicle that can be driven in all weather conditions. I mean, the climate in California is beautiful, but we don't all live in California, right? So we have winter here, obviously. So a self-driving car needs to be able to drive in the winter. So at the University of Michigan, the M-City campus, we've been testing our autonomous vehicle technologies in snowstorms because a car has to be able to negotiate and you know the, the roads, even in blizzard conditions. Many of Ford's newest models, like the Fusion Platinum, Sport, and the 2018 Mustang, come with features like adaptive cruise control, parking assist, and even pedestrian detection as standard equipment. So we recently announced that we will be selling a fully autonomous vehicle in 2021, but we already have a lot of semi-autonomous technologies available today. So uh, here is the Fusion Sport. And the semi-autonomous features that we have, for example, are adaptive cruise control with lane keeping assist. So what that does is the driver can set a preset distance with the car ahead of it on the highway. And if the car ahead slows down, the car with cameras and sensors will slow down automatically. And if the car ahead speeds up, and then it will speed up to its maintain its preset speed. Now, in case there's a traffic jam on the highway, there's stop and go technology on this vehicle. So the vehicle will come to a complete stop by itself, and then when the traffic clears, the car will accelerate again. This car can also parallel park itself and perpendicular park itself. Again, using cameras and sensors, it makes parking in the city very easy. There's also pre-collision assist with pedestrian detection. And so uh, if a pedestrian should be crossing the street and not looking left and right before they cross the street, the car will detect that and will come to a complete stop. So these are some of the technologies that we have available today. While Ford knows how much joy its customers get from actively driving and being in control of vehicles, it knows that autonomous technology is the way of the future and says that its features will be available to those who want them. A lot of owners like to keep control and, and uh, you know, love to drive the vehicle, the pleasure of driving. So we, we think that owners will always want to, a certain extent, uh, keep control over the vehicle. But for those drivers who are looking for more of those technologies, they will be available. But Ford isn't the only manufacturer developing key autonomous technology. We visit the BMW booth next to see what the luxury automaker has up its sleeves.